This Chirungu uh, one-stop uh, border post uh, is one uh, or the first uh, of its kind in the whole of Africa. The operation of the one-stop border post is going to bring down the transit time from about seven days to a few hours. And, and that's a phenomenal development. And on the north-south corridor, we're trying to speed up the time that freight takes to travel from the, the Copper Belts in, in Zambia and the DR Congo through to Durban or to Tanzania. If countries can agree that for this border post, we can do things on my side of the border and your side of the border as two countries, is a seed that should germinate and germinate fast. It's good for people, it's good for Zambia, and it's good for everybody. Both border posts were originally constructed as a traditional border post, where vehicles would stop coming from Zambia to Zimbabwe and from Zimbabwe to Zambia. So what we've done now on the one-stop border post concept, all vehicles leaving Zimbabwe will not stop in Zimbabwe at all. They'll drive straight through Zimbabwe and stop on the Zambian side. This sign here shows exactly how we're going to split the traffic. All freight vehicles will go into the terminal area and all passenger cars and buses will drive straight down this road and over the Sorotto bike bridge. All freight traffic will go into the terminal and there's a fast track booth. So those trucks will actually clear in the cab. They won't get out of their cab. exciting day because it is a practical demonstration of regional integration and you must agree with me that right at the beginning you actually saw a cultural regional integration because you saw both our dances both from Zimbabwe and from Zambia. The opening of the Chirundu one-stop border post comes at a critical phase in our economic relations and demonstrates partnership that embraces the benefits of regional trade. I am delighted by this development and wish to congratulate the governments of the republics of Zambia and Zimbabwe who worked tirelessly, often for long hours, to make this concept not only a reality, but a success. The development of the structure we are seeing today is a milestone in facilitating effective trade in the Kometsa region and beyond. Chirundu's strategic location as a model of trade between Southern and Eastern Africa and its role as a gateway between two busy regions has made the port an ideal choice as a pilot site for the one-stop border control program. Uh, we are more excited, so things will be easier for us Zambians to travel to another country. I think that this is the beginning, but at the moment let's give them a chance and see how they're going to improve the situation. I'm very proud that that border is helping us. It's starting today, eh? We need to give it a bit of time, but from the look of it, I'm sure it will work. This is a good day. It's a good day for all of us. Well, for us, this is a landmark uh, day. Uh, we are so proud that uh, the first uh, such uh, border post has been opened and officially launched. It's the first one on the continent. It's the first one in the region. And, uh, I believe that uh, step by step, surely, we are going in the right direction. That two countries can actually um, put the legislation together, harmonize, which is what we are looking for in the wider you know, uh, regional cooperation agreement, uh, integration agreement. 
given the volume of trucks that are going through the Turinda border post at the moment, uh, on average that means that every day there will be a saving of one man year of waiting time and that's a huge cost to business. Uh, when we did an analysis of the cost of transportation, uh, given the infrastructure that we have in place, it was recognized that most of the time and inefficiency was arising due to stoppages and detention at the border post. We used to spend three, four, five days, but now we're spending hours. It's a big event for Zambia and Zimbabwe, but also it's a big event for the region. When people come around here and they're told that this is a regional integration project, they're able to attach greater meaning to this, saying that, wow, if this is regional integration, okay, then we are for it. So the idea now is to uh, un un unleash a program that attends to the other border posts, and this is part of the tripartite program in terms of uh, attending to the border posts within the corridors identified within the tripartite of the Comesa, EAC and Sada. If these kinds of efficiencies are going to take place, we are going to reduce our cost of doing business. Our exports and imports, you know, will be much more competitive. And this will mean uh, a lot to, uh, to our regional economies. Uniting Africa after so many uh, years of being independent states and having various challenges, is not uh, very easy. But this region, one of the things that is uh, um, happening is that we are creating the environment for business. This is a project that falls within the North-South Corridor. It opens up a much broader geographical economic space that cuts across actually three regional economic communities, you know, Kamesa, Sadak and the East Southern communities. It's a defining moment in terms of regional integration where we have a practical project that we shall replicate now in the rest of uh, the corridors. Since we opened the Chirundu, I think the next one we must do is the one at Bedford. Yeah? So that the uh, goods that are destined for Zambia, goods that are destined for South Africa from Zambia, should move at fairly uh, fast speed. Initiatives such as this will now give us the leeway to improve on the efficiencies to allow throughput without uh, much delay. We do hope that we'll upscale the activities on the uh, Bible's border post which is led by uh, our colleague from Sadat and also the Malaba uh, border post between Uganda and Kenya under the East African community. This is a continent of values and this is a continent of hope. So when we saw the development today, it came to my mind that uh, I think that we are moving in the right direction. So let's keep the momentum and I think that uh, the history one day will register that uh, we started from Chiru. Chiru, Chiru, Chiru.